What's up, YouTube? This Star Wolf. Hey, look, I got a question. How do y'all feel about uh, Marquise Houston being engaged to a 19-year-old uh, female? How do y'all feel? How do y'all feel about that? Do you feel that love is love and he should be left alone and everybody should just stay up out of his business and allow this to happen, even though it's going to happen? Or, I mean, how, how do you feel about it? Because the way, look, the way I look at uh, this is love is an act of will, okay, first and foremost. So age shouldn't be a matter. What truly matters is psychological and spiritual age, meaning the person's mental state now. I'm going to get off into that. Okay. Both of, you know, both of them, you know, both of the qualities are often, you know, the couple's qualities is often complement, you know, it's complementary. You know, they complement each other in some type of way. Okay. One party has experience, stability, while the other has enthusiasm and vitality. But is that the case here? Is she is she mentally capable of going into a relationship with someone that's 20 years her senior? That's the question. And apparently her parents, you know, they, they don't care. Everybody's parents is happy about the situation. So my thing here, and me really, I don't care. I just want to know how everybody else feel because, you know, mo the, a lot of people was wondering if he had dated her when she wasn't of age yet. And we all know that the legal age is 18, but that's just a number. On a piece of paper. Those are rules. Those are laws set in place. By the government. So. The reason I'm asking this is. Because. Your mental. Your mental stability. Doesn't change. Your mental faculties don't change. When you change age. You 17 years old. And you become 18 doesn't mean that everything automatically changes. So with that said, do you feel that she's really mentally capable of handling a relationship of this magnitude? Someone of this magnitude, such as Marquise Houston? Do you really feel that is love? I mean, he stated that, you know, they both they both had Jehovah's blessing. I'm I'm taking it that he's a Jehovah Witness and she's probably a Jehovah Witness. If she's not, she's going to become one. So he stated that, you know, and he stated that everybody should stay up out of his business. They shouldn't even be worried about what's going on. They should be worried about his business. They should be worried about what's going on in the world, especially about, you know, the, the pandemic and everything of that nature, which he has a point there. But here it is. You know, I mean, this is not the first time. I know people looking at this because he's a celebrity. There's been many celebrities who've dated and married younger women. Um, some people may look at this as being pedophilish. pedophilish. Some people may look at this as he probably was... Messing with her when she wasn't of age, you know. They look at it as being statutory rape. Um, it's a lot of things people, you know. He he he's being drugged for this. There's a lot of people that don't like this. I mean, I have a daughter that's 18, and I have one that's 16, and I wouldn't allow. I couldn't allow it 
And the reason I couldn't allow it is because of the mental state that both of them are in. Because they're not mentally capable of handling a relationship, you know, taking on adulthood at that at that point in their life. There's some young women that's able, like in other countries, um, you know, specifically Africa, many of the tribes, many of the women in the tribes, you know, when they start coming on the administration and coming into womanhood, they, they deem that as coming into womanhood, you know, they, they marry at a young age. But the reason they marry is because of the customs, how the customs are, and the customs are different, and they're bred in a different manner to where their mental state is different. They prepare for the world in which they reside. Now, living, with all, living within America is different because these young women are not prepared. In fact, you have women that's in their 30s and 40s that's acting like they teenagers. So, you know, I'm still asking the question. Is it love? You know, love is love. Is it love? Should he should he go forth with the marriage? Or should he not? How do, how do y'all feel about this? How do y'all how do y'all feel about this? You know, I'm I'm you know I really don't care one way or the other. Just as long as he don't hurt the young sister's feelings and destroy her to where she gets in her twenties or late twenties and you know she looking like she in her forties because she was stressed out and now her mental state is just ruined. You know that could happen. I'm not saying. That Marquise Houston would do that. But I've seen it done before with many women. So, I mean, let me know how y'all feel in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think of this. Or whatever, you know. I mean, they going forth with it. Hey, let them be blessed. Let no negativity come their way. Because they going to get married. But uh, let me know how y'all feel. Anyway, I'm Star Wolf. Uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you're new to my channel, I thank you for tuning in. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and that like button on the way out so you can get my videos when I drop them. You have to hit that notification bell. Some of y'all are not doing that, and I know that you not receiving the videos too, but you have to hit that notification bell so you can get my videos when I drop them and make sure that you share all my videos on social media platforms. Peace.